The 41-year-old pop star shared a public rant on Instagram following claims online that her family and loved ones had tried to stage an intervention. One source told the outlet TMZ that they feared Britney would die if she continued without help. On Friday morning, the toxic singer took to Instagram to clear up the most recent speculation around her well-being. She shared a motivational quote, reading, A state of gratitude will shift you to a higher frequency. In the caption, Britney told her 41 million followers, It makes me sick to my stomach that it's even legal for people to make up stories that I almost died. I mean at some point enough is enough. The singer noted that if the public reaction continues to be like this she will have to stop posting on Instagram. She added, there's obviously a lot of people who don't wish me well. I'm honestly not surprised at all. Britney reassured her supporters that she's doing the best I can, especially as she was only freed from her conservatorship just over a year ago. The Baby One More Time singer added a little life update saying, It's 2023 and I'm making my first homemade lasagna at home. I finally got my fireplace to work in my living room. As my hubby says it best, don't believe everything you read. All that love right back at ya. On Thursday evening, TMZ released reports claiming Britney's husband, Sam Ascari, her manager, doctors and an interventionist were planning an intervention to persuade the pop star to get treatment. A source told the publication they were afraid she's gonna die and noted that the singer had agreed to meet with a doctor. However, another source told Page Six that the intervention was cancelled as it was deemed unnecessary. Don't miss, the source speaking exclusively to Page Six alluded to the hysteria surrounding Britney's well-being that the pop star herself addressed on Instagram, noting that it had been overblown and grossly distorted. These claims come shortly after the police were called to Britney's property to perform a welfare check. Concerned fans had called the emergency services after the singer shut down her Instagram page. However, she soon returned to the platform reassuring fans she was not having a breakdown but simply still exploring her newfound freedoms. She wrote, Yes, I took my Instagram down and now it's back up because I can. Being able to volumize my voice in a world where I lost my rights, for 15 years, gives me an opportunity to succeed. The womanizer hitmaker admitted she's still learning this no rules thing and feels younger and in awe in her life. However, Britney also berated those who sent the police to her saying it went a little too far and my privacy was invaded. She highlighted that the officers had never actually entered her home and had left shortly after finding no issue.